Hi all, Karen Doll coming at you. I owe you guys a huge apology. I didn't do my vlog the last couple weeks. I was kind of sick. Um, sinuses, allergies, head cold, all that fun stuff. The weather's been, you know, 70 degrees one day and then 30 the next. So naturally everyone around here sick, including me. Like literally last weekend, all I did was sleep. So I know I said I was gonna let you know who the winners of my Shopkins giveaway was. So congratulations to Jennifer and Lisa. Um, Lisa did message me and let me know she got her Shopkins package. I don't know about Jennifer. So if you're watching this, if you can just shoot me an email, let me know you got the Shopkins. Be awesome. Thanks. Um, I'm actually going to start uh, showing you some stuff that it's going to be in my Christmas giveaway that I've picked up already. So, you know, we're going to get to see some of that. Um, I want to apologize too. I haven't been posting as many videos as I usually do. Um, in the morning, I kind of, my routine's all screwed up right now because I go to work earlier than I used to. So, working on getting stuff posted. I know I've posted some stuff here and there. So, bear with me, guys. I'm still working on editing a lot of things, editing the movie stuff that we've been working on and all that. So, I'm hoping with having uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday off next week for the holiday should be able to get a lot of stuff done. Fingers crossed. So hopefully some of the um, movie stuff we've done um, will get posted here soon. I was going to share with you a few things I did pick up. I got a couple things a couple weeks ago and I did a couple things tonight. Um, I haven't done another toy hunt video. Um, it's been kind of crazy out with, you know, Christmas and everything coming up. And I've been out like during a busier time of the day. And, I, and as I've said in uh, um, some other videos, there's some places that are very funny about you filming. Um, and I actually haven't been going to my usual Walmart the last, like, two weeks I've gone. Two times. I shouldn't say two weeks. Two times I've gone. I've gone to another one because I've been in that area. And they actually have, like, security cameras around the toys. So I don't know if they would come and say something. And, like I said, it's just been busy with a lot of people. So I am planning on doing additional uh, toy hunt videos with you guys. Just not sure how soon I'm going to do another one because of you know, the chaos of Christmas coming up. So I'm going to show you um, a couple things I got a couple weeks ago and then what I just picked up tonight. So like I said, I have, I took, as I said, I haven't been at the Walmart I usually go to. So I don't know if this is at all the Walmarts or not, but I have picked up two of the Star Wars Force, Forces of Destiny. Uh, these are new like Star Wars dolls, like whole girl power type thing. Like I said, I think they're trying to target you know, younger gir young girls and all that. So I have uh, Princess Leia, Orte Organa, Ortega, oh my God, Organa with R2-D2. And then I got Ray of Jakku with BB-8. These uh, two, I believe, retail for like $24.99. The Walmart I stopped at, they had them on sale for, I paid like $19.99, I think, a piece for each of them. And when I stopped today, they, they were still that price. So check your local Walmart on some, um, some stuff. Like I said, this one is not one I normally go to. They had a lot of things that were marked down, I think, with Christmas holiday coming up. And if you guys have watched my For Real Friends Tyler review, they had him for $94. And it was still that price tonight when I stopped. So if you were kind of hesitant because of the cost, I would definitely go get him for that price because that's even less than what we end up paying for him. But we got him when he first came out. And then... Uh, I did a five below run. Actually, I went to two different ones, but um, they had some Monster High dolls for five dollars. Um, it doesn't say what series these two are, but I knew I didn't have these two, so I have Dracula and Frankie. I really, um, they had a couple different Draculors, but I like this outfit she had on, and then this Frankie, 
I just, her hair was different. So I was like, yeah, as much as I have the, a number of these dolls, I'm like, I want to get these two as well. So like I said, we're going to do some opening reviews um, after we get the vlog done here tonight. And then also at another Five Below I stopped at, and I'm going to do a video where I just open all these. They had their Christmas go gross grocery game. Woo! Grocery gangs. And then I found their Shopkins Christmas ornaments. And then I also found a random Shopkins pumpkin. I have not seen these anywhere. I've seen some reviews on them and I love like it because they were like all Halloween-ish. But this is the only one I found. It was just randomly placed at the five below I was at. So I grabbed it. So I'm going to do a video with all these together here tonight. I'm actually going to put these guys back in the bag. So it's going to be a little bit of a Halloween and Christmas combination. And then tonight when I was at Walmart, I picked up and this guy, these guys were marked down. They were, I shouldn't say marked down, but they, yeah, they were cheaper. <laughs> they were marked down, I might say $7.46. So I got the Justice League Batman. This is more for Bob. <laughs> so I am going to review him with you guys. Um, it says on here there's Superman and Aquaman as well. But I didn't see either. Like this was the only one of him I found. And then I found Ray. It says Jedi Ray Jedi Training. Um, this one was, I believe, 746 as well. So, um, but it was, this was, no, they had a couple of the stormtroopers, but Bob had a, several of the stormtroopers, so I didn't grab it, grab any of them. But also tonight when I was at Walmart, what is it, the 18 inch Jack Pacific ones that they have, they actually had a Ray one there tonight too, but I didn't grab her because it looked like it was a little marked up. So I want to keep an eye on that as well. So I'm going to open those with you guys tonight. And then I also got another flip -a -zoo. These guys, this is one of the larger ones. I'm not going to let you, I'm not going to tell you what it changes into, but as you can see, it's a unicorn. So I absolutely had to buy it. Um, these guys were marked down to 10. Um, normally they're like 14 to 88 at Walmart. That's where I, that's the only place I've seen this size. Like I haven't seen, I haven't even really seen flip -a -zoo at like Toys R Us or Target. But also tonight when I was at Sam's Club, they had the jumbo ones and they were 30, but I didn't get one of those. But like I said, I saw this was a unicorn. Um, they were down to 10. So I grabbed her. So I'm going to review her and you guys will get to find out what she flips into when I'm done. And then another thing I'm going to review to you, with you tonight, and actually, hold on, <laughs> shouldn't have placed this over here because I'm, this is, and this is going to be real, this is kind of funny, um, I have an app on my phone, it's called Top Hatter, it's kind of like, uh, I don't want to say it's like eBay, they're like 90 second auctions, you can bid on stuff. So I downloaded it just to check it out. I've actually have gotten several things off of there and there's only been one thing I haven't been happy with and I'm still waiting for that to be resolved. But um, they had on there, and this is in Chinese, Japanese, something like that. They had these little handheld games systems and there's 268 games on here. Um, I actually have one open because I've actually gotten three of these. I kept one for myself. One of these is going in the Christmas box my, for my Christmas giveaway. And then I got one for a gift for somebody um, as well. Um, I actually, I've been playing with mine a little bit. Um, there are 268 games on this. Which, you know, you look at this little thing and you're like, really? There's that many games on here? Um, yeah, and it's like a lot of the old Nintendo games like Mario Brothers. I think Super Mario Brothers was on here. Dig Dug. Um... Some of them I think there was doubles of. I really haven't played all the games yet. And it's really cool, but the only thing is, because I'm older, the screen is really, really small. That's like my only complaint. And otherwise, okay, so it's made in China, so this must be Chinese on here. Um, otherwise, I think it's really cool. Um, the only thing, like I said, for me though, is sometimes I can't play it real long. But it's kind of nice having like some of those old school type games on a small system like this. So I'm actually going to review this tonight as well, even though, um, like I said, one of these, this is going to go in the box. This is actually mine. So I'll kind of show you guys everything with it. And if you're interested in the site, I'll, like I said, it's Top Hatter. I don't know if they have a website. Like I said, it was 
it was something that came across either in one of my other apps there was an ad or it was on Facebook and I thought oh I'll check it out and it's like they have this stuff they have jewelry they have a bunch of stuff actually and I've actually like I said I've won several things um, and several things are gonna be Christmas gifts and actually there's only one I've been unhappy with because it arrived damaged um, the shipping was real poor some people you know it's like I read the reviews before I bid on anything there but it's kind of it really it's kind of like eBay if you've ever used that or any other sites like that you know if stuff's not packaged right it's going to be damaged and that's kind of what happened with the item I received that was damaged so and then I have um, one more thing to share with you so we're gonna get them and we'll be right back as you can see why we had to cut away um, this Jagunda bear I found at Dollar General tonight when I stopped. Um, it says on his tag he's a plush super bear. He actually kind of looks similar to a bear we bought at a grocery store last Christmas, but he's a different color. And kind of the reason I grabbed him, he retailed for $30. Um, <laughs> Dollar Gem was having a three day 50% off all plushies. So got this guy for 15 bucks. Um, I actually, hold on, he's kind of, there we go. I look like I'm choking him. We'll lean him back. There we go. He can chill. Um, <laughs> I actually was joking is when Bob, I got home tonight and Bob came out to the car. I said, don't be mad at me. I picked up a hitchhiker and his look was like, what the heck are you doing? But like he said, knowing me, he wouldn't be surprised if I did pick up a hitchhiker because I had this, him sitting in the front seat with me. <laughs> so, um, a giant plushie like i said we have another one i think they're we were looking and they look exactly the same so um he's very soft he's got big red bow here in his mouth and all that i'm not going to do a review even though i'm kind of doing a review but i just want to show you you know like you never know where you're going to find something you're looking for and like i said i had stopped at another dollar tree a couple months back and that's when i found that um candy pops doll i reviewed kara um and it was like, you know, it's like you don't know what you're going to find in certain places or you can go somewhere. Like I said, the one, the one on him we got, that's, I, like I said, I think they're the same one. The one we got last year that was this size. You did, we found it at our local, one of our local grocery stores. I mean, that's the last place I would expect to find a bear. Um, so I had to pick up this guy tonight as well because he's just, he's soft, he's chubby, he's fluffy, and I could just lay on him like this all night. So, um yeah, but he's a big guy. I was actually uh, walking around Dollar General and knocking stuff off the shelf with him because I literally stopped in just to grab a couple things I didn't find at the grocery store. And I didn't grab a cart. I just had a basket. So I'm literally holding him in my one arm with my basket in the other. And I'm just like knocking crap all over the place with him. So, But I honestly don't think he would have fit the cart there. So we're going to cut away one more time because I'm going to get him moved out of the way. And then I'm going to show you the couple things to start my Christmas giveaway with you guys. So I think I showed in one of my previous vlogs, but I didn't have the box together, that this was the box I picked up to do my Christmas giveaway. So I'm going to try to fill it as much as possible, but I'm going to show you a couple things. I wasn't going to. I was going to keep it a surprise, but I thought maybe you guys would like to see what all I'm putting in there. So as I said, one of these little gaming systems. By the way, this takes three AA batteries because I'm probably not going to put the batteries in here because with it being cold, they're probably going to, they would drain in shipping. Honestly, I buy batteries at Dollar, uh, Dollar Tree all the time and they work fine. So like I said, one of these is going to go in the box. And I mean, I got this kind of, I like games. I, I like to play video games. I still play video games to this day. Then I picked up, I got this at Target. It says two scented sticker sheets of Nom Nom. So they, oh, they're different. I didn't realize that. So there's two different sheets in here. I actually found these, um, in case you're looking, at, I found them at Target up in the um, spot area or whatever they call it, like the bargain area in the front of the store. These were a dollar. I'm gonna just tell you, they were a buck. So um, I thought, you know, some of you have always want, like the num num stuff. So I got one of those. And the final thing I have right now in the box got kind of damaged because I've had this one for a while. This is uh, a Shopkins Apple Blossom Vinyl Collectible. I have not done a review of this yet. I We actually have um, all six of these guys when they were out. And then we got a couple of the Chaser ones. They were like a different color. Like, I don't, there's the back of the box with all of them on there. You guys probably aren't seeing it real well. But um, 
these were made, um, you know, most toys with Shopkins, but these were made by Funko, you know, who does the vinyl pops. I've reviewed a couple of things with that. I collect them myself. And these are actually very, very adorable. So like I said, we have the six that they show on the back of the box, but then we got um, the Apple Blossom Chaser, which is a different color. And I think we got the Lish Donuts Chaser, and I couldn't, we never found, because uh, I think each of them had like two, and the one, it was the Chase, what they call the Chaser one, and it was a different color. So, right now, still got some room in the box. So I got to look for a few more things. Um, I haven't edited some of my um, blind bag videos that we did a couple months ago when I had made a, I had taken um, a tub and bought, I was buying a bunch of blind bag stuff. So I may, I was going to do giveaways with that stuff, but I may throw a couple of those items in this box as well because um, I picked up some Lego ones, like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle Lego ones and a couple other ones. We got some duplicates, so I didn't put them together, but the bag is open. So I'm um, going to probably try to go through all that stuff here this weekend. Um, I think I have a couple things left over from my first giveaway because I didn't have a whole lot of entries. So um, the few people that entered, I sent a couple extra things to them, but I didn't want to send certain things because it was like I had dubs. So I might be throwing a couple of those things in as well. So. I'm hopefully going to get the box. I, I, I'm sorry. I keep looking away from the camera and looking at the box. Um, hopefully going to get the box filled here. Um, my goal would be by, I'm going to say December 8th. If, actually, I would like to do it by the 1st, but um, have a couple of work parties and stuff coming up. So I'm not sure how much time I'm going to have to go out and look at stuff. I'm actually thinking about throwing some arts and crafts stuff in there too, since I'm kind of starting that as well, which we have filmed a couple videos with all that and like I said, not feeling good, not getting editing done. So that's my big, big project here next week with the holiday and everything in between coloring and cooking a turkey or coloring. Oh my God. Decorating and cooking a turkey. So uh, I think that's going to be it. Like I said, congratulations to my Shopkins winners, Jennifer and Lisa. Hope you guys were enjoying the products. I know um, Lisa sent me a picture with her daughter who was extremely happy that they won. So like I said, I'm going to do more. I'm going to have the Christmas giveaway. Once we get the 500, it's going to be the big giveaway. Like I said, holding off till closer to that time to see what the giveaway is going to be. I had already said about the three prizes. Like, there's going to be a big prize, a medium prize, and a small prize. So, you know, there'll be three winners out of that. Um, stay tuned. I am going to do some more toy hunt videos. I just don't know how soon those are going to be just because of the holiday chaos coming up and everything. I'm going to be getting more of my reviews up. Like I said, if there are certain things I review and you're looking for, definitely check like the toy catalog, check Walmart. Cause like I said, there was a lot of stuff marked down with everything. So stay tuned for, uh, you know, editing more videos. Um, trying to think how far I'm up to right now. I just posted, I think the last one I posted was monster high Pauline. Cause I had gotten her. So I have, um, few more I have actually um, I have a good many edited but I have a good many more to still edit so you know I'm gonna be trying to get them up as quick as possible my goal was to start getting them up like it's shortly after I get them done but unfortunately illness ran rampant so I'm not feeling too bad right now still a little stuffy but you know it's that time of the year so we'll get through it I think that is everything guys Thank you. You guys are awesome. Um, thank the subscribers. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Slowly, slowly making it to that 500 mark. So, you know, help share my page. Um, I know what I wanted to put out there too. And I wanted to do this in my last vlog. I know I'm getting ready to sign off and my mind's like, oh, you forgot to talk about this. Um, I currently don't feature any other channels on my channel. So any of you guys out there that have a YouTube channel, if you're willing to feature my channel, I'm willing to do it in return. So hit me up in the messages, hit me up in the comments, you know, I, I, th I think YouTube is, you know, you know, it's one of those things where you can help each other as well to promote yourself. So, you know, if, like I said, if you're willing to help, you know, promote my channel or put my channel on your page, I'm more than happy to put yours on there as well. Cause like I said, it's just helping each other out. And then also, because I know a few of you I do communicate a lot with in the messages, and I know some other people do this. If you guys are willing to do like mail swaps on things, you know, hit me up and we'll see. We'll see what we can do about that. Cause I've seen a lot of people doing, I don't want to do like fan mail. I'd rather do it something like, 
hey, there's something I'm looking for, but and you can find it in your area, or if there's something you're looking for and I'm able to find it, you know, I'd rather do a swap than like fan mail or anything like that. So, you know, like I said, helping each other out. I've been in a lot of trainings recently where it's all about helping each other. So maybe that's part of the reason why I'm like this, but I know that was something I wanted to bring up in my last vlog and totally forgot. So like I said, let me know what you guys think about that. Hit me up in the comments. Subscribers, I'm going to get back to you. Thank you. You guys are awesome. Love you all. Keep coming back. New subscribers, welcome. Hope you're enjoying things. Uh, 500 for that big giveaway. Facebook, Twitter. I know I haven't said it yet. I think that's it. So we're going to get some openings done here because I have some new toys I want to play with. So we will see you guys in the next one. I'm hoping, hoping, hoping. I'll get my vlog, I'll get back on getting the vlog up Friday, Saturday. So I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.